this is gonna be the worst match of all time. We got Kaiju with jump control. All right, we got Link, I believe, versus a. Yeah, Mark. this is gonna be the worst match ever played, viewers. Uh, I suggest having some mute. Oh no. Oh wait, is that <laughs> intentional? Okay, not intentional. That was unfortunate. See, I told you it's gonna be pretty bad. So, I, viewers, I would suggest maybe getting on some DMT. Maybe maybe hang out with uh, Walter White. That might also help. We'll make it go easier. I'm not suggesting that. No, this is these are not. These are, I'm not asking you. These are just. Oh, no. Um. <laughs> okay, you're gonna need so strong with the DNT. You're gonna need that straight, hard like, from the from uh from from the what was that? What's that browser that allows you to go to the dark web? Like, you know what I mean, like I go that deep. I mean, stuff. onion browser. The onion tour? browser, yeah. Yeah, tour. Yeah. That's what I think. I'm not going any further than that. Obviously, your speaker players gonna take you off comps. No way, you can't, cause no one else is there. But <laughs> oh, you can say whatever you want now. Yeah. Oh, Chum does something! Wow. Oh uh, yeah, I believe Chum did fight a Martin pool. Uh, three of the pools had Martin in them. I uh, did pretty well. So needs right to do the math of what the odds are of not playing any of the three mods. Like, first of all, you have to have the one pool without any of them. Yeah. They have to not run into either, any of them. I mean, it might be zero percent if, if like any of the mods win the game, like any of the games, like. Okay, and like, here's the thing. Unless you're from winners and you won the pool that didn't have one of the three mods. So which would be, I don't know the pools cause I don't care. So Ste Steven and who's the other second? Oh yeah, so Steven Knight had not played a Marth. For Knight, that's that's great because GV Marth makes sense. If fair enough, but uh, fair enough, fair enough. Pika, you think you think GV beats Marth? Fair enough. I'm saying okay, that that's really awful. Great fun that that yeah. upbeat was really bad. That you should feel bad. But uh, alright, there is a game plan coming out of Chum Patrol. Uh, Chum Patrol is pressing projectiles, so we're trying to oppress this Marth. Not even a game plan. This is a vague concept. It's like saying, "Oh, my game plan is." Yeah, the game plan is to eliminate the, the opponent's stocks. I think Chum Patrol is thinking of that right now. It's not a game plan. It's like that's that's just the objective. It's not a game plan. <laughs> what is happening, bro? No. What what are these? What are these edge guards? What is he doing? Uh, He's it looks even... very rinse and repeat. Just uppy. Into you, know, you, you know, you know when it, like what me watching Chump try to edge guard Marth, it's like you know that polar bear that's in like Detroit or something like that. What was it? Arlington, mm. Texas, I think. It was Arlington, Texas. <laughs> the show was turned up. <laughs> like literally, like like Chump's edge guards are like he's up being as an edge guard instead of like anything else. <laughs> I, I guess it's a wide hitbox, so we had to get Chum any credits. You can catch a lot of recoveries of that. Bro, like Chum, only Link can get away with being off stage and just wanting to end the game and just recover, and no one can do anything about it. There we go, another upbeat. Woo! I do doesn't know how to close. This is really annoying. Because whenever you have these like bad games where neither player really like, a oh my. God. Oh well. Okay, at least. IG took a lot of percentage from that ledge crapping from patrol did. last stock, fair enough. But it's also a situation where... <sighs> the, you know, the problem the patrol didn't throw away two stocks, that game might have went different. That's true, that's the thing, is that like, Kaiju doesn't know how to close, that Chump had a chance if he just did SD twice. Yeah. Like, we're on the PC now. Hopefully there's more two types of players. Cause the thing, I'm not a great player either, I literally played two hours of friendlies with uh, Astral and got destroyed and got like one like two games in like 40 games <laughs> So like clearly I'm, I'm not gonna but, but the thing is the gap between me and Astral is just because Astral is one of the best players in the world and I'm me So I feel like that's that's like understandable when I watch matches like these I feel like there's two types of players like so how do I say this? New, not even newer because Chelsea's been around long with that, about as long as I have to be honest So it's not even about new uh, Underwhelming players like that's a nice way of saying it. Like we have two middling players you have two types of them. One that don't know what they're doing, but like happen to put themselves in a situation that are like okay. And then ones where the game plan is good, but they don't know how to close the game. So like Kaiju's more like he doesn't know how to close the game because maybe he gets nervous or maybe his he doesn't have like the guarantees that like the, you know you know what the idea of guaranteed goods or like safe commodities? 
Like, Kaiju doesn't yes. have a safe commodity. What is that? But but Chump is like, because he knows how to close, because he's played for so long, he has won that much in his entire career, but he's won enough games. Well, as we seen like... from Blaster yesterday, Marth up tilt is a pretty safe commodity if you get your yeah, opponent Kaiju up tilt. Yeah, Kaiju wasn't using it much that last game. Like, you, you know the idea of, like, playing perfect is the opposite of playing good? Because if you play perfect, you don't realize, because this thing, playing perfect isn't how you win. Most of the time. Obviously, if there's, like, an easy way to play perfect, like, if it's, like, a standard play, then obviously you do that instead of doing the random play. But, in the concept of be playing perfect is that you end up trying your absolute hardest to do, like, it all perfectly to the point where you end up getting nothing. You know what I mean? Like... If you try to just be good, like just have an all-around game where there is a flaw, but you just try to play around it, it's a bit, it's much easier to just win. Like, you know the idea of like trying to play a video game like chess is wrong. We try to play it like chess because chess is a game where all the options are like finite and are specific, while a video game can have more variables than a than a chess game can. And when you try to do that, it, like it doesn't work. Like Kaiju tries to play SO2 like chess. And Chump is playing like it's like pl it's playing this video game like he's matching the, the control stick on his face. You know, yes, and to that, that sounds insightful if you don't question. True. And here's like, I think I'm being reasonable here because like, nothing Kaiju's doing is wrong. Like he's just doing some small misinputs. He lacks confidence, which makes sense. Kaiju hasn't been playing for that long, from what I remember. Like at least way less time than Chump is. Like Chump's only really winning because Chump knows what a win condition is. Specifically, he doesn't know how to get there because he's never he doesn't have a good neutral if I'm being brutally honest, but Like Chump is it's like, they're, Mainly when Chump wins neutral, he has to get a ton of damage, which he has mainly been doing this game and at times on Yoshi's Again, Link is Does a lot of damage in general, but you know what I mean? Like But like you see Chump is actually winning neutral that much is that every time he does win neutral He gets like 40% when Kaiju in neutral. It's like 15 so it ends up getting out in that sense, but I, it's probably the character difference because Link as a character True. does a lot of damage, even if you mess up, you're getting something. True. Cash brought this all the way back. Oh yeah. No, okay. Wait. That that grab was. I hate this game. Help did the worst grab ever, but because Link is ridiculous, he didn't get punished. Yeah, you I've seen that, some right? crazy other grabs land. Yes. Like it's not even that. Here's the thing. It missing is is good. I like that it missed. Cause just because it proves that like you can't just press the button and it works, right? That okay. I hate that Chump just does options. bad things and he gets away with it. It's I know I sound like I'm being a hater here, but like, but as someone who's just like, oh my, wait, Chump might lose this. Well, at higher levels of play, you get that beaten out of you. I guess Chum Patrol oh, okay. has not had in that beaten out of him just yet. Yeah, not yet. Yeah. Like when I play against Astral, whenever I made a small mistake or I approached for no reason, because Astral's a camper. I don't get it to us. Astral's mad campy. Like people think Astral's flashy because oh Astral's a really cool combo. No, Astral camps like a motherfucker. Do not get it twisted. Like Astral will wait for you to okay chop good close it. That's one one of each, but But uh <laughs> What I'm trying to say is that like I I I know what my point was. My point was that like Chump obviously won that at the end of the day, but Kaiju, again, you saw it. Kaiju has good ideas, just, you know what I mean? Those little finesse. Yes, but while, while playing probably. as Astral, anytime I tried to approach that isn't like an amazing approach, I died, essentially. Like, basically, I had to like win, like the first, be up a whole stock the whole game, because when I'm down, he, like Astral just nicks and dies me, me enough times to win the game. Alright, and whenever Kaiju does win neutral in this matchup, there's not enough of a punish game uh, to really sway the difference. So Chum Patrol's just throwing out What's all the... of this stuff. He was in the VC, why is he... Forget about it, right? 1-1 one, one each, I don't mind the stave run back. Kaiju was losing a lot in that game, and Kaiju brought all the back, so I can understand the run back there. And Kaiju brought... Oh okay. my god! Incredible anti-air. That down air was oh, depressing. Like, again, Kaiju's good ideas that are like the right thing to do. It's just these little errors. I know you're probably thinking, isn't that just Marth in general? No, I've seen some, some Marths that do the wrong thing. Like, I'm not calling anyone specifically out because I'm friends with most of them, but like, I'm gonna say, there are times where the Marth doesn't do the right thing. Or Marth does the right thing, but it's really one dimensional. Like, Kaiju isn't going for just the same thing. Like, he's actually waiting for mistakes and like, He's doing the smart thing. 
sometimes you know you know no, I, I think of ideas in smash as the 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 easy stuff the hard stuff and the important stuff i took that from bobby scar like and i think it's a fair sentiment you know like for example the easy stuff is like the bnbs for example right the hard stuff is like the really specific tricks like oh like is it example like you have a really cool way to shield poke or a really cool mix up that that's like the hard part and the important stuff is like understanding like weight class and how to like edge guard those are like important stuff for example I feel like Kaiju can do like the easy stuff and he does uh, some of the hard stuff but doesn't do the important stuff like the like I mean like, Edge Link is difficult fair either of the players do the important stuff Chump the only the does the important stuff in my opinion like Chump barely does any of the easy and none of the hard stuff but like he yeah, does all the important stuff like he does enough damage and like he wins the important neutral interactions that's why this set this set's pretty close that's not it Okay, okay. God, that's a nice snipe. Decent bomb throw, at least. There we go. Nice little down air to start up. Shrink. Oh, it's pretty close. Oh no, that's a. Oh, I thought you died. I hate Link. My guy was near the bottom of the blast zone. Okay, not literally, but that guy was low, low. Oh, yeah, the actually, I love that attack. Actually, I love that attack. He didn't get the kill, it's but that was a really good like way to like reposition it. Look, look at this beautiful, amazing edge guard. Good ledge trapping. Again, like absolute just finesse there. Just golden child. Oh my god! No, oh, oh right. It's crazy how like I say Golden Child and Pika Play says Drake, even though it do a trick. Everything has something to do with Drake, somewhere. Fair enough. Dog, no, Drake is all like 80 songs, dog, shut up. It's like saying Simpsons did a Drake wrote something to that effect at a certain yeah, like, point. Yeah, like bro, Drake said, oh, I did practice, Drake, because it's a Drake song called Practice. <laughs> like, oh, <God. laughs> what do you mean, oh, this song called Finesse by Drake, so is it Drake? <laughs> bro, uh, shot for me, bro. Someone shot me. Shot for me. <laughs> I got shot. <laughs> I'm a legend, Drake. <laughs> oh no! Oh, good kill, Drake. All right. Embarrass Save him. No, why no he attempt at spacing it out, but still Dude, getting the stock anyway. anyway. He owned his soul anyway, but that was... Bro, Kaiju is a legend. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we don't see shield drakes like that often. You said shield drakes? Shield drakes. Uh, shield breaks like that often. <laughs> shield drake. Shield drake me later. No, we can't. <laughs> <laughs> I can't do this, bro. I'm gonna, I'm gonna faint. Like this is. Okay. Good little down air conversion there, but not enough knockback to actually kill. And then these Marth strings, Marth is so floaty, you can just swat aerials in the air, rack up a good amount of damage. And Kaiju really is catching on to Chum Patrol's place though. Kaiju is baiting out all of these options, which Chum Patrol will throw out every time. There is definitely a bit of a more patience punish game coming out of Kaiju so far. However, Chum Patrol going all out there with that Link Forward Air. Link Forward Air is kind of a disgusting move from everything I've seen of it. That was a very nice Marth conversion, using the platforms to Kaiju's advantage. And <laughs> that is, it's fine. Hello, Pika. Hello, Scrub. I have a burger. All right, nice. Yeah. Uh, Drake made it. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, when rappers fall off, they usually just start restaurants. It's only a matter of time. Yeah. Oh, what a reversal. Nice. Turn around back face, whatever that backer's back called. Here. I I would have I would have hit that uh, back here. About face? Is that I what Marth backer? Just call it nice bear. Oh. oh. Awesome up B. 
I guess there are moves in the game that are named. Uh, they even... turn. A, they turn you around. Yeah. That's what that move is. Backer that turns you around. Beach that makes you old. All right, there we go. <laughs> We're bringing that back. Could have maybe no been an F smash there rather than an up tilt. I don't know if F smash reaches that high. <laughs> it it reaches decently high, and if it does, and as it I've tippers. mentioned multiple times, Marth F smash is an incredible anti air. Always yeah. tippers. Oh, he. Okay, he didn't grab ledge. Nice. Hit him anyways. Oh, nice tech. Nice. Uh, no later. reversal. Back to neutral. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that dash attack nearly nearly hit him. Oh, random dash attack again. Let's go. Jump patrol. Okay, good fade away. Back yeah, I'd throw. say the bomb added a bit of pressure there, preventing Kaiju from just running in. Yeah. Landing dare? No. Okay. Okay. I wish. Up tilt. Uh, who is he grabbing? Marth up tilt. Okay. Blink up tilt. <laughs> Marth up tilt is better. Uh. True. It, it it does kill. Okay, but Link up tilt leads into Link downer, but Marth doesn't have Link downer. True. If Marth had Link up tilt, I think he might be better. What do you think? Uh, what could you get out of that? Like maybe an up B? Like you just up jump up up B? B? Oh, also speaking of which, we're at game five. Anyway, Chum Patrol. Ooh, a game five. Ooh, I love the number five. Scrub, what's your favorite number? I, of all of them. Yeah. Uh, let's see. It's always gonna be like some edgy answer, like zero. I'd say zero. Mine is seventeen. Okay, decent. Seventeen again, Zac Efron. <laughs> seventeen or forty-three, one of those two. I it's I think in general, just odd numbers are more cool than even ones. Fair enough. I don't think you pick an even number as your favorite unless it was maybe two. Yeah. If you're lame. It's like what, like sixteen? What power of two? I have no idea. Okay, I'm back. Sorry for... Hello, baller. What's your I talk to some number? people. Six. All right. Six. Well, okay. Okay. I get the Drake. relevant six. Drake. No, no. I didn't mention Drake. No, no. Y'all know my 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 origins. No. You don't know. I know. I know. I actually. Well, I know you, you know. Well, what are you? Did you to come say? from the six? Is that what you're no, saying? Oh, my fucking. What's your username? They used to mean about it all the time. Like sixty-six. Exactly. Got you, got it. All right. So it's it's not sixty-six. It's just two sixes. No, my two favorite numbers are six and two. That's why I have two sixes. Oh, okay. Well, want me to, unless you want me to have six twos. Sixty-two. Two, 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 big baller two, 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 two. What is your opinion on Towel Boy being blasted by all that water? <laughs> they should have used their magic for good. Yeah. <laughs> why would they uh, use that... it for evil? Big time. Is, is that big time rush reference? <laughs> oh yes. no. Yeah, that is. Yeah. I, 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 I started... thing. I He's make an iconic reference. You don't. You don't understand. Because I just a big started time watching rush. Big Time Rush. Bro, I'm sorry. Bro, all I'm gonna say with Big Time Rush is I. I wait. Here's the thing. That's actually the best Nick show ever. Yeah, it is. Yeah. It's true. It's actually. I mean, here's the thing. People will say, "Oh, fucking, uh, Drinking Josh redacted, uh, <laughs> iCarly redacted," but like the the real the real best like sleeper is actually BT, BTR. Like, because I actually watched some of the old Nick stuff because I'm bored and I had time. So I actually rewatched like a, I think all of BTR, all of Ned's. Cause I've already, I watched Drake Josh way too many times, so I'm not gonna rewatch that again. And I rewatched I car like a year ago, so I watched all of them within the past like two years or so, right? And BTR is the best one actually. People give it to Drake and Josh because like they, they, here's the peak Drake and Josh is the best kids show ever. Like it's actually unreal how good peak Drake and Josh is. Like that show's unbelievably good. Like. Especially by season three and four, that shit was absolute f fire, like pure fire. Yeah. I, I know. I know you didn't watch Obvious Peak of a Scrub. I'm assuming you watched some of that at least. I uh, that was near the end of where I started watching. I was beginning of iCarly is when I started watching Nick. Okay, so you watched the end of Drake and Josh at least, right? Yeah, I watched the end of Drake and Josh. Yes. Like the last season or two. Yeah. So you agree that shit was fire? Like that shit got was pretty good at its best. Like. Yeah, it was pretty nice. Yeah. Yeah. The way I would rank it, like, if I rank the four, 
because this because Trump's gonna win this game, like unfortunately, because the evil wins. No, literally. Oh uh, no, yeah. Don't you just you. Just, just uh, the, the evil wins. Yeah, Trump, Trump wins this. Like this should just be done. Like Trump is camping. He's doing the right thing. He's up three socks one. There's no reason for him. Never to approach. approach. Never approach. Never punish. That's he's, 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 he's got rewarded for camping, which is what you're supposed to do, right? If you're winning, yeah. you want to keep winning. So. And Kaiju is playing nervous. This game's done. Like. Oh yeah, this is falling apart so fast. And that, and he got a grab. It's, it's done. Like, hey, that's who cares. At least Kaiju's good at the back here. Why is Kaiju game? not like countering anything? I don't think he remembers that counter exists. Fair enough. I guess yeah, yeah. This is an example of when you want to play the the perfect smash. Yes, because perfectly, smash. March Sword outranges Link. So if you space it right, you're gonna tip her and hit first. You know the idea of like when you play the good S set two, you end up missing. No, when you play the perfect S set two, you miss the good S set two. In the sense that you try to do the perfect move, but because again we're on the internet and obviously because humans will make mistakes, you end up just basically just giving your opponent a free. Oh my God! There's no way he. No, it's yeah. not. Exactly. No, no, evil wins. Just, this is just evil this is wins. wasting time. <laughs> why did not he not he, he, Why is he not jab down smash? I don't what think is wrong with knows him? that you can jab jab down smash. I think it's been too long. <laughs> that hit. I hate this game. I hate this game. I'm happy this this character's getting neutered. I'm I'm happy. Like he's getting his balls cut. I'm so I'm so happy. Like F smash. <laughs> oh, Mark is, is the guy who cuts it. Moth sword will cut those balls back nicely. Piss back throw at that point. He's at 160. Up Thank you. Kills. Okay, up tilt. All right. The the the, the depression is over. <laughs> Let's go. Chum patrol taking a 3-2 over Kaiju. Very back and forth. The 1920s Dust Bowl has continued. <laughs> I love the yeah. Dust Bowl. I love that. I love that game. Dust Patrol. <laughs> <laughs> Chump Bowl. Oh. Ch Chump Bowl, Dust Patrol, I don't care, like, the Dust Bowl, the 1920s continues, the 2008 is stock market crash yeah. continues. How, he, Chump Patrol is easily the oldest SSF2 player. No, Gax. You wouldn't think it based on the play saw. You think it'd be more refined. Nah. No, it should be less shit, let's call it, bro, this is Flame Mountain, <laughs> this is not, this is not, it's not AFM, this is not FFC, 